Hello operators, Boundary is gearing up for a comprehensive content update, including the adjustments of the main menu structure, art book and original soundtrack, a PvE mode and improvements to the overall combat experience. Detailed information will be provided in the update note. And now, let's dive into the main highlights of this update through this video. Main Menu Adjustments We added a new Overview tab, providing players with convenient access to frequently used features. Currently, Quick Play Entry is available on this page. It allows players to swiftly join existing PvP game or create a new one. With relaxed matchmaking rules, starting a match will be quicker. A new Gallery tab has been added for players who have purchased the Elite Cosmetic Bundle. Here, players can explore the art book and listen to the original soundtrack. Additionally, players who unlock the art book will receive a new weapon ornament, Art Book. Gameplay page now includes entries for PvP mode and PvE mode, making it easier for players to choose their preferred game mode. Player vs. Environment mode After the update, players can fight against AI enemies under different difficulties. We currently offer three difficulty levels, Easy, Normal, and Hard. It allows players to choose according to their skill level and practice their combat techniques. Depending on the selected difficulty, players will earn different experience multipliers for character and weapon. Higher difficulties provides more experience. Combat Experience Adjustments In this update, certain mechanisms related to combat experience have been adjusted. The character's backpack mechanism adjusted. Based on players' feedback and data analysis, damage reduction of the character's backpack will be removed after the update. Attacking from someone's behind will now cause fully damage. Meanwhile, players will no longer be misled by feedback from accidental backpack hits. The automatic health regeneration mechanism adjusted. After this update, players need to fully restore their armor before automatic health recover, which means players need to ensure both armor and health are fully restored. This way they can avoid being at a disadvantage during combat. Side pod launcher firing adjusted. To enhance the effectiveness of pods in combat, some pod will be fully automatic launch now instead of manual. Players only need to press the corresponding button to fire at the current aiming position immediately, even while firing main weapon or using mobility devices. This rule applies to HE grenade, EMP grenade, impulse grenade and snapshot sensor, making tactical items more convenient during intense battles. Battlefield information adjusted. To improve the quick readability of the minimap, horizontal lines connecting the player have been removed. Information such as capture points and excessive interactive elements has also been removed, leaving only the display of enemy and teammate positions, making the map focus on quickly locating threats. For more details about this update, please read the official content update note. Operators, we hope this updates bring you a better gaming experience.